after adding this we will set some width here so let's set some width here I am setting this 30 percent and here is 40 percent so after adding this we will add a title class so let's add a title class here and inside of this we will copy this title here to help so you can copy or you can write any type of title and let's heading here here I am typing this is one class the heading and I will write this description in this p tag so let's type this description here so after adding this all of this item in this for this call one property so for this call one and now we will write this all of this element css for this call one title first we will write css call one title for this color and this six times from uppercase and let's set this font size here 1.5 rem it will be perfect so now we will set here some margin and padding okay let's set this call one for this some margin here i'm setting some margin that is 30 pixel 20 pixel okay let's set here margin again called for call two and after setting this margin here so now let's i don't know this font style is not working that font family so let's type here another font family that font family maybe my browser is not supported so let's type here this let's copy this title close and this everything and now we will change this value is is one for the heading tag and we will set this font size will be by default and here we will make only the colors because this font already increasing size by default here so i don't need to any changes so let's change, set this margin for this element is of element here i am setting this 10 pixel 0 from the top and bottom and this left to right is 0 here and let's set this some css for this description here so i have set this color margin and the font size the font size here i am going to making it all the same as like title sizes so after adding this now let's add a padding on this call one so here i'm adding this 10 pixel and 20 pixel okay so after adding this padding so you can see now it's looking like this so here you can see this with this now if we increase this skin here so you can see this full type of text so now here we'll change this margin from here so from i'm setting this margin from the left side is eight percent so it will be moved from this left side to eight percent and now let's set some more values here Okay, now let's go to this call one and now we'll set images here that is image is not a exactly image it's also a svg images support img.svg and this img this svg link you will find in my description so now we need to type for this css for this images so now let's copy this call one where we'll do type this call two and this for img item we are going to writing the css so first of all here we will set some width here so let's set it 500 pixel but it's not still going in the resize mode so we'll decrease size more this 350 it's getting very smaller so let's set it 400 pixel now it's looking perfect like this okay now this almost is it was almost set here so now when we are going to check it is responsive so it's not responsive here so now let's type code for this mobile responsive i will show you that in this full skin in this full skin is crazy it's also not working responsive but this also here a background is not working perfectly so we'll set this background also but let's first talk this let's make it a responsive mode so here this media query will type here this max query is here i'm setting this 500 and there is we will make it for this container let's say this container is display block when we have typed in this this flex and this block item it will be make this all item in goes to the column sorry and you can see the max query is we have set is 700 pixel and now we can see like this so when we did it and when we make it try to responsive here so it was going mode in this column but this here this height is mentioned this background so we'll decrease this height is coming to side and now you can see this this background height is fully covered this skin here so now we'll set this for the css for this another property here that is call on property we'll set uh, this 90 percent with this here and we'll set margin 10 pixel and auto so that this all item goes to in automatically by default in center so let's go to type for this margin call to and let's type this set this size for this call to for this with this here i'm going to set the same with this here and margin also the same and now let's type for this img tag okay let's set here this with here that's i'm going to set is 100 percent so that it will be adjust by this skin size but this image is this right side is getting this it was getting this box with this so now we'll set some margin for this images so let's set this margin left here we'll make this left side in moving move to left side is 20 pixel so now you can see we have some enough space on the left to right so now this we have already completed that so now we can see this mobile responsive is working here 
but this top and bottom we have some this background this body background we haven't any color so we'll add some color on this or body background so let's